In this video, I'd like to talk to you about data pre-processing with Weka. So you open Weka Explorer and from here, open file. You select the file churn.csv. I open the file and here it shows me the list of all the attributes and here I have uh, 21 attributes. So I'd like to look at the uh, data. Look at, click uh, the edit button, and look at the data. In the last attribute, tune tune is a class attribute. We can see um, there are zero and one. Looking at the attribute. The type is numeric and it looks uh, not very correct so here I'd like to change it into nominal. So I select the filter, look at uh, unsupervised and look for numeric to nominal and I click into it and I select 21 21 is the index of the tune attribute and click OK then apply so now I check the attribute again and here it shows me nominal now we look at the attribute phone we can recognize it as nominal and this is good we attribute area code we can recognize it as numeric and it's not uh, correct because we look at area codes and we compare if they are the same or different and that's it so area code should be nominal so we apply the same filter here and this is the 19th attribute I apply the filter to area code and that's it state is nominal and it's good now and here I'd like to discretize cut serve calls using two bins so I select the filter discrete highs and then uh, select the index 7. The index 7 is the index of gas serve calls and select the number of bins as 3. And I leave other um, options by default use equal frequency is false so it, it is actually uh, equal interval method here then apply now we look at the attribute again you can see that the attribute now has three bins Attribute values from negative infinity to 3 are discretized into the first bin. Attribute values from 3 to 6 are discretized into the second bin. And attribute values from 6 to infinity are discretized into the last bin. And now I need to normalize the rest of the attributes. 
so I click choose and look for normalize and I leave all the options you know, the default values and then click apply and if we, I go through each attribute I can see that all attributes are normalized and the minimum is 0 and the maximum is 1 minimum 0 and maximum is 1 